Will Bruin win the header? Will Bruin once again. Critical finish from Bruin. It had to be him. Will Bruin against his former club have given Seattle Sanders the lead. I think if most of us are honest, we can say that when we saw Will Bruin traded to the Sounders, he's going to be a guy who's going to help off the bench, their attack was set, but you've kind of come in and flipped the script, you're scoring a bunch of goals, you're doing that, like have you surprised yourself in some sense? Either? Um, you know, I've kind of had that my whole career, people being like, oh, you're, you're too big, you're too slow, you're not good at one particular thing, so it's not really... Um, you know, I didn't really look at it as, hey, look, I'm going there to be a guy that comes off the bench or, you know, a Champions League next year and stuff like that. Um, you know, I wanted to make impact immediately and, you know, I think I've done good enough job to make Brian have to make some tough decisions and, you know, I, I, all I can control is what I can control and that's, you know, working hard and, and putting the ball in the back of the net and, you know, I, I remember I told Brian, I was like, you know, I'm, I'm a double-digit goal scorer in this league, I know that, and now i got to make make sure I keep my word and get there. <laughs> Why do you think it's clicked though here in Seattle? Like, what's been the secret or the reason behind it? Just going really well. Yeah, you know, playing here, this team values possession and I think that's really important for me as a center forward. Obviously, I can go 20 minutes in a game without touching the ball and obviously that, that gets frustrating as, as a forward but you know if we're keeping the ball in possession I'm fine with it and we got great passers and we have great guys all around the field. We have great guys all around the team um, that are pushing to make to get in the starting 11 or in the game day roster of 18 so I think that brings everybody's level up and you know that's something that this team, the team chemistry has been been really good. Will Brown in behind! Critical finish from Brown! First chance of the match and the first goal for Seattle Sounders! They lead by a goal to nil. The one thing that surprised me this year is when I think of Will Bruin for me, oh, he's going to be a good hold-up guy. He's going to get guys into the game. But you're making runs in behind. Your goal against Orlando comes to mind. You know, you're, you're chasing guys down. Your your feet are a lot better than people give you credit for. Um, do you sense that at times that people kind of pigeonhole you into this because of your size? He's a hold-up player, for but sure. there's a lot more to it. Yeah, hundred percent. But you know, I look at myself, and the way I've always described myself is I'm kind of a hybrid. Um, I can definitely play hold up and be the big physical guy but I like to make defenders think I don't want them to just you know think I'm gonna check to the ball and try to fight and hold up because then it's easy for them kind of to keep me in front of them I like to check and go or run in behind because you know defenders don't like to run and chase and and you know that, that, that makes it fun but uh, you know with the good passers we have I think the space is in behind sometimes and you gotta exploit it. One of the things this team has done this year is dug itself into holes in games and being able to come back. Um, is that, have you, have you guys taken that as a positive thing, look how resilient we are, or is it why are we in a situation in the first place? What's been the team's approach to that? Um, a little bit of both. I would say more of a why are we in the, that place in the first place, because we know we're too good of a team to put ourselves in those holes. And you know, sometimes we do. You can say teams are capitalizing on their chances. It's not like we're getting played off the field and team scores two or three teams, are, they're scoring on us. And you know, when, when teams take their chances, it makes it tougher on us because we have to be patient because a lot of teams will bunker in against us and we've noticed that and you know, that's just, that's just how it is sometimes. But um, some of it is due to, like I said, they're making good finishes, they're, they're scoring their chances, but also like we gotta, you know, when we have the ball, we gotta know that anytime it could be intercepted, it's a scoring opportunity for other teams they're gonna counter on us. So, um, you know, you take the positives of the resiliency, but we would like to, you know, keep it at zeros and go from there. The ball's going to fall kindly here for Will Bruin. A clinical finish. Sixth goal of the season for the former Houston Dynamo man. And the Sounders have doubled the lead. 2-0.